There you go. All right. So here's a um, here's my simple picture of y equals x squared from x equals zero to x equals one. Just made mm -hmm. it a little bit bigger than we had uh, the last time, and we're trying to find the area under the curve here. All right. Which um, you know, I'm not I'm not sure that's a problem. You've really spent a lot of time thinking about before. Mm -hmm. Well, Do you have any idea? <laughs> Sorry about the dog snoring in the back. It <laughs> sort of looks like a quarter of a circle, but there's no way of knowing if it's a quarter of a circle. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. But well, let's pretend it's a quarter of a circle. What 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 would we do then? So if we want to just to imagine that if it's, it's it's a quarter of a circle, we know the area of a circle is pi times the radius squared. Okay. So to find the area of this whole circle, we do pi times 1, so it would be pi. But we have to divide it by 4, so the area would be pi over 4. Okay. So that's like, it's, it's a guess. I'm, we're, there's no way of telling if this is actually the curve of a circle. Okay, well that's, that's actually really interesting. Now where is that pi over 4 area? Why don't you shade that in? It's below this one, so it's in here. Okay, and what was the area we were trying to find? Below here, so it would be here. Yeah, maybe, do we have another marker on somewhere? I don't know if we do or we don't. Um, Sometimes there's one over there. Well, not today. It's okay. okay. But all right, so what we're trying to find the area below, below this. So, so shade that in, what we're trying to find. That's down here. So, I guess this would be 1 minus pi over 4, because this whole square we found was 1. Okay. And so that's, that's what that would be. So that is... Mm, right a little bit lower down than okay. that. Um, or maybe so over here you can bring. Minus pi over 4. And that's about 0.214. 0.214. Yeah. That's a great that's a great guess. Now, you said there's no way to tell if this is a circle. Yeah. But I suspect there probably is a way to tell. What? So the, the graph of a circle normally is x squared plus y squared equals something. Mm -hmm. And that's telling us the distance away. So the points on this, uh, if this was a circle, they would all, all the points on this curve would be the same distance away mm -hmm. from the center yeah, of the circle. Be, uh, one so away. Where's the center of the circle? It would be up here. Okay. So why don't we pick a point and see if it's distance away. Let's pick a point on this curve and see if the distance away from it is one. I mean, we know this one works and we know that one works. So maybe it is a circle. But so what, what's another right. point we could test? Maybe a half. So this is the point half one fourth. Okay. So that that's the line connecting it. So we need to figure out that distance. So going over this way is a half. This is three fourths actually. Okay. So we can use the Pythagorean theorem, which says that half squared, which is a fourth, plus three fourths squared, which is nine sixteenths, equals this length. Yeah. And this that this should equal one because one squared is one. Okay. This turns into four sixteenths. We add it up and it's 13 sixteenths, which means this is not the curve of a circle. Ah, okay, so it, that's good. So there was a way to tell. So is this point closer to here or farther away than if it was a circle? Oh, it's closer. Okay, so does that mean our estimate of the area, assuming this was a circle, is our estimate too small or too large? Um, our estimate's too small. Too small, okay. Too small. All right, so maybe we, we have now a conclusion that the area under y equals x squared is actually a little bit more than 0.2. Yep. Because we know what we subtracted away before, we don't know, but we're guessing now that what we subtracted away before 
is actually a little bit more. Yep. Cool. Hey, that's a really good guess. Um, that, was, that was a really neat idea. All right, let's let's go to the next. One.